Hey, KIC here. Welcome back to Life in Bunker. Even though we've had a pretty good start, we're not really in the best position right now. Yeah, we've um, we've had some problems. And in fact, here, let's, let's open those spots up right there. I've been trying to... Hello, cat. Trying to get some of this stuff out of the way so we could get some more mm, resources to have building materials. And we have other issues going on right now. We don't have enough electricity. We're pretty much, as you can see, at maximum capacity on that guy. We probably need more food. We're about to have people retiring because they're, you know, they're getting older. It's about that time that they're going to retire and we need to take care of them, which means we need to get some of this stuff taken care of out here so we can actually do all the things we need. We actually need to do a little bit of building too, but we don't have the resources to do it. So. It's kind of a problem right now. Cat, you gotta you gotta knock that off. That's not cool. You're making me, I don't know, steer all drunk-like right there. There we go. Not cool, cat. This is a drunk-free show, ideally. Okay, since I don't drink, it's pretty much guaranteed. Let's put more flooring down. We need to have more flooring down. So at the very least, we can leave that for the moment. We have, um, well, a few resources coming in this way, but not a whole lot. We should probably consider spending some of our research points. Let's go ahead and do that. Here, let's uh, close that for the moment because I'm still fighting with my cat. She wants to repeatedly headbutt me, which is all well and good, but uh, yeah, it's, uh, hmm. it's something. Okay, I think I want to do that guy right there. Slightly faster building is A-OK -okay in my book. Let's go ahead and do... I don't really want to spend anything over here yet. I do kind of want to do the dance machine, though, just because that would give us some better options for resting, relaxation, general health, that sort of thing. We do want to do that one. That's going to get us a little faster ore. Um, let's go ahead and do that one. And... Hmm, I think maybe we should go over here to food and let's go ahead and increase the fish. There we go. We get fish and vegetables up to maximum level. I think that'll be a good idea. Let's do this guy. We're down to 86 points, so we're okay. And then just taking a look here. I think that might be good enough for now. And then let's go ahead and do that one there and that one there, because they're going to spend less time at the doctor now, and that'll be a good thing. So this guy's moving a little quicker now, getting us resources so we can make some additional building materials. It looks like they have that wall in place. We really need to set down another, uh, what do you call it, reactor type thingy, the jigger. Now, we could research this guy right here, but at 500, that's just going to take a while to even get to the point where we can do anything about that. And we have this problem right here of we need to build more waste containers. I don't know how we're going to do that when we need other things first. It's quite the conundrum, actually. So my thought is maybe... Oh, yeah, I know. You guys, you need everything. I feel terrible. We can't even build a garbage recycler. We can build a mining machine, though. So we're going to go ahead and do that. The idea here is that... We're going to get resources twice as quickly, and in fact, you know what, we might spend some research here shortly on, uh, you know what, that's not going to work because we don't have enough power to run that. That was, that was a waste. That was a total waste. Oh, man. Well, if this guy, well, okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to buy a few moments. When this guy is done and we have some new embryos, we're going to turn it off for just a couple of minutes, long enough to get some additional resources so our refinery here can go ahead and create some more materials to work with. Yeah, you guys, you can't get away from the warden's watchful eye. We need more engineers. I like the sound of that. And another cook. I like the sound of that, too. And another janitor. I like the sound of that. Really, I just like the sound of anything that gets them working. And absolutely more people working on getting food. That's going to be critical. I really do believe that. So these are about to pop out. We're going to turn this guy off as soon as it's done. I should be able to turn it off. Okay, we're going to go ahead and turn that off for right now. That way this guy is running. It is working. And we have absolutely used the 
every little bit of power we have. And now we have a problem that we don't have enough air. Ah, crud. I'm going to have to turn something off so we can get 10 power. Now, let me pause it so I can figure out what we're going to turn off. We can't turn off any of our food thingy-majiggers. We need our food stuff. You guys, you're going to have to lose that for the moment because I need to turn that guy on. There we go. Now we have enough air. Man, this is really, really rough. I really do want both of these running, though. I feel like that's going to be the only way we're going to be able to get enough resources so we can put another reactor down in time. Oh, boy. Look at that. It's waiting. I mean, this one refinery, since we've upgraded it quite a bit, is just keeping up, and it's... It's actually working faster than these guys can. Okay, we do have some more research points available, so let's go ahead and spend them on... Where were you? This one... Okay, you guys need to work twice. Well, maybe not twice as quickly. I would be happy with twice as quickly, but you definitely need to work a little quicker here. So we've increased the time on that. We still need 350 resources here so we can build a new reactor. Man, this is painful. This is this is rough. Especially because these guys don't have anything to... Uh, what's the problem now? We... Hmm. Someone clogged the pipe by flushing their goldfish. I mean, I get it, you know, flush your goldfish, but maybe not in this particular instance. That might not be a good idea. So I have a couple resources over here. I went down, in case you didn't see what I did there. I just went down. That is another rift that's going to go down. So I'm just kind of checking out where all these things are. I guess the rift over here. There we go. Okay. So I was just taking a quick look because, uh, you know, we can. I know, guys. I am sorry. Your, your trash is just filling up, and I really do feel really bad about that, but I can't do anything about it right now. Uh, I really can't. There's just nothing I can do about it. How are we doing on fish? Not bad. These guys, this one is about to be done, so we're actually almost at the point where we need more vegetable storage, but it's okay. Someone's going to come along and make some food, and then that'll get rid of some of the vegetables we have in storage, so that'll be fine. Oh, look at that. They are getting a bonus because they're making stuff with multiple ingredients, so that's why we're we don't have a whole lot of fish because they're getting these meals that'll actually give them a little more, I don't know, I guess fullness. I'm not sure what all that translates into, actually. You know, let's go ahead and kick that one up a notch. I would like to put an exercise bike down so that, you know, these folks could use it. The problem is I just plain need everything here. I, I can't do anything about it right now. I don't have any additional power. I guess what we could do... Oh, this is brilliant. This is brilliant. We're going to open that door, turn those off, and then because here, look at this. Yeah, I just got some power back. There you go, guys. Get your treadmill back. You need it. I need you in tip-top physical shape. That was a stroke of genius right there. Yeah, I'm calling that genius, even though I'm sure someone was screaming at the computer, tablet, phone, whatever you're watching on. Dude, just turn your doors off. I didn't realize you could do that and save power on them. Makes perfect sense. In fact, here, well, that's not really going to be worth it. What do I have to spare for? Yeah, it's not really worth it. So I could turn some lights off and that would get two kilowatts back per, but two isn't really going to do me any good at this point in the game. It's really not. So I'm not going to concern myself with that. How are we doing? These guys are still extracting. They're coming along. We're getting close. We need to figure out where we're going to put that reactor. I'm kind of thinking it's going to go... We can get into the right menu here. Right over here. That's kind of what I'm feeling like right now, is putting it right here. Maybe it's not the best place, and I had kind of thought maybe we have two refineries right there. Just because, you know, they would fit nicely, but... I don't know. Um, I think that's going to work. Let's go ahead and increase the time, the speed, just a little bit. Not a ton. Just a little. I really feel bad. They have trash everywhere. This place just looks like a mess right now. I feel terrible. Sorry, folks. You you just you don't deserve this. You deserve better than this. And I'm really not helping you out here. Just out of curiosity, are our fish coming along? They're coming along okay-ish. Just looking at it in terms of resource cost, and the aquarium is not as good on a one-to-one -one basis as the vegetables basically takes twice as much, but it doesn't produce twice as much, so that's kind of interesting. 
Got a pipe break. That's not good. Oh, sorry. Power cable, rather. I don't know where that power cable is to. It looks like everything is up and running as far as I can tell. I don't know where that broke. We're almost at the point where we have enough resources to build a secondary generator. So we're going to take care of that in just a second. So close. So, so close. We're almost there. Okay. What is that one? Not enough space for vegetables. Oh, crud. Yeah, I, I told you that was going to be a problem, didn't I? Yeah. Bummer. Um, you just need to make more food quickly. Quick, fast, and in a hurry. Okay, let's pause. We're going to pause because we are at the point now where we can place another generator. So let's place that generator. We need life support mini reactor. I keep calling it generator, but it's reactor. We're going to place that guy right there. And then because I can already see it happening, we're getting rid of those right there. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this back on. Oh, we got snots. We have a snots infestation here. Probably needs more beds. Although, I keep thinking that folks are going to um, retire or I'm just going to plain kill people off. Unintentionally, of course, but that hasn't really happened just yet. Has not happened, which I'm kind of thankful for, really. All right, guy. You are going to get over there. You're going to get that reactor online. And as soon as you do, I am turning a bunch of stuff back on. Because uh, I feel bad about this right now. I really do. Okay, come on. Get that reactor up. In fact, here, while you're working on that, I'm going to start placing floors. We need some more floors. I want to make sure that we get that done. All right, look at that. We have our reactor up. Let's go ahead and pause. We're going to turn stuff back on. So let's go ahead and turn the doors back on. Power to the doors. And then we also need power to our incubator. We do have some resource points to spend. So I'm going to make sure we get a scientist. And... Hmm... I don't know what else we need. Maybe an engineer. We need one of them. And then... Maybe another cook. I don't know. Another cook or another farmer. Hmm. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, you know? I'm going to say... A cook farmer. I like the sound of that. Okay, so resume. There you go. Now can I do it? Thank you. I didn't give it a moment to catch power, so it was kind of complaining like, hey man, what are you doing? You can't do that. Knock that off. Probably going to need to place another bed, so let's go ahead and put another bed down. Uh, probably, you know what? I probably shouldn't do that. I should wait. I should wait until we have enough to... until we have enough to put down a garbage... Just gonna call it incinerator. It's not an incinerator, though. Here, let's go ahead and let's get rid of those two. We need to get rid of a few more blocks. That's fine. I know we got trash everywhere. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. Sort of. Kind of. How are we doing on power? That one's at 444. This one's at 56. Just taking a look. Where are we at on water? That one is pretty much done, and this one is the one that now has some free space on it. That's interesting how that worked. That kind of flipped around on me. I mean, not a big deal. It doesn't matter, but just interesting. That's all. Just as a point of discussion, I find that interesting. How is this guy doing? 140 ore. Okay. As soon as we get 150, I think that's what we're going to need. Let's take a quick look. Residential zone. No, it's in production. Garbage recycler. There it is. For 250... Okay, so if we were to just do a storage, that would be 50 for right now, and that would that would clean things up a little bit and get them not living in filth. I'm going to go ahead and do that just for right now. We're going to buy them some time. They have junk everywhere. I don't like that. That's not healthy for them. It just looks bad, so, you know, let's just go ahead and do that. Ah, Haley the Slacker is old enough to work. What can you do, Haley? Where are you? Hmm. How many? One, two, three. Uh, no. You know, Haley, you're going to go ahead and do that. Yeah, you're going to work on food and stuff. I like that. All right, so we have our waste container taken care of. How many janitors do we have? One, two, three. So we have enough janitors. We're fine on that front for right now. Our janitors will get around to vacuuming up that stuff. 
ba -da -ba -da -ba. All right, so Yabby Jithkiri and Sergey are ready to work. So Abijith, you can be a cook. We have four cooks now. That's kind of ridiculous. Uh, you can be an engineer then instead. And Sergey, you're going to be a scientist. We have four scientists. Yeah, we're going to have people retiring here very quickly. Yep, there we go. They are... Ah! It's fine. Whatever broke, it's fine. The kitchen is broken. Yeah, someone will fix it. See, we got an engineer. We have plenty of engineers. Okay, so here's where it starts to get interesting because we need to figure out what we have left as workers because all these folks are retiring. So all the ones right here... Oh, man. These ones are about to retire. I'm just taking a look here. You're about to retire, so we're going to be good on that front. What do we have over here? We need you to be a worker that way. We only have one cook left. So let's do two cooks because this guy's about to retire. We'll put Aaron on general worker for the time being. And that only leaves us with one, two, three, because Akira is about to retire. We're good for now. We can work with that. Akira is going to retire, and then we're going to lose, well, yet another person. Here we go. There you go. Akira retired. Yep, you guys are all retiring. And Aaron just retired. He was one of our cooks. So I'm just going to give it another minute here because we should have our last ones retiring momentarily, assuming they have not already. Okay, I think that was all of them now. If we take a look, so we have one cook, an engineer, one farmer... A janitor, so that's pretty much everything. We have two scientists. We can really use another scientist. We have another one cooking in the embryo machine, so we're going to be okay on that front. We have one worker, though. Only one worker, so we really do need some of these young ones to get old enough to work. That would be really helpful, except we don't really have any. They're all they're all already old enough to work. We're kind of... Um, we're going to be skating by for a little while here, honestly. It's not going to be pretty. Yeah, it, it's not going to be good. And that one is full, and that one is full. <laughs> and there's still junk everywhere. Oh, it figures. I knew that was going to happen, but it did buy us a, a few moments. So, you know, it's okay. We're going to speed up time a little bit here. We really do need to get up to 250 resources so we can get a garbage recycler. And then we really need to talk about going downstairs. So we're going to need to research a lift. So let's go ahead and research... Uh, where do we want to go for that one? Is it over here? Maybe it's over here. A lift. Let's go ahead and research the lift. That's going to let us get downstairs, as it were. Hmm. You can dig a lot faster. That would be kind of nice. Disassembling. Sure, we'll go ahead and research that. Just for kicks, why not? 15. That's not going to be a bad thing. 20. We're going to have a lot of digging to do, so that's fine, too. Oh, yeah. We need another fridge. Both of those are full. And our fridge is full, so we can't actually do anything about that. Ah, so much to do, and we don't have the resources to do any of it. This is craziness. All right, so we have enough to put a garbage recycler down. Garbage recycler. There we go. We're just going to go ahead and pop that guy down there. Someone's going to take care of that. I think we only have one worker who's going to have to take care of all of it. Yeah, I know. Not enough space for, for more vegetables. We could really use another storage box. Another fridge that takes 75 resources. We're pretty close to that. We'll be able to do that shortly. My goal would be to be able to do that. That would be nice. I think that would be in our best interest if we could go ahead and get a second fridge set up for food storage. I think that'd be a good idea. Okay, that garbage recycler needs water, so let's go ahead and run a water line to it. Water pipe. So... Cannot run... Oh, I think that actually counts as water. Here, let's do this slightly more efficiently. There we go. So we'll go ahead and take care of that. Wrong button! That one! All right. So we're going to get someone to place some water pipes right there. We're going to have enough water for everything still. We're okay. All right, look at that. We got some babies, so we need to turn another one of these guys on now. So we'll turn our last air purifier on. If we need more, then I probably should work on building another large air purifier, the big air purifier. How are we doing on that pipe construction? 
We're not. Someone decided to take a break. Okay, that's fine. They'll be back. There we go. Residents are starving. We have enough food. We just don't have enough cooks. That's the problem. Okay, so let's go ahead and queue up some more of some more of these guys. We're just going to do random. That's fine for right now. Probably shouldn't do random, but it's going to be fine for right now. We need to also build a new refrigerator. So let's go ahead and put you down right there. And with any luck, someone will build that. But that's where we're going to call it an episode. Yeah, I know. We need more stuff. But our lone worker is really not doing anything because I think she's kind of busy. Yeah, and it's not working out very well right now. But it's okay. We're surviving. We are surviving. And... What? what? Those are going to be ready soon. We're going to have some more fish. Look at that. Our garbage recycler is working. It is slowly recycling. I wonder if it takes out the whole chunk. I don't know if it does. Did it take the garbage out of there? It sure didn't. I guess it's just taking it out of storage, period. I wonder if we can research that to do any faster work. Because that would be nice if it could... Uh, uh, that one, I think, is going to be... That one right there. Yep, that's the one. That makes it go faster. Good. That's what I need to see. Because we have garbage lying around everywhere. That's what we're calling it an episode, though. We have a functional garbage recycler. We have some more embryos cooking. We do have power for a little while. We're going to need another water pump very soon. This guy's going to run out of resources before that one does. Although they're both pretty close, all things considered. And generally speaking, we're kind of hanging in there. We're not doing too badly, but I'll catch you on another one. So thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me know what you're thinking about this series. I'll catch you on another one. Thanks for watching. See you later.